because I think it's important about mentors and environment. Yeah. And you said there's this, you know, twenty three year old guy. Yeah. Um, inspiring and and of course inspiration nation, right? So, yeah. right, you know, in my own, the reason to set this whole thing up is because I want. You know, I want to find inspiration, and those people mm. out there want to be inspired. Yeah. You said the magic word. I thought, well, okay. Yeah. So talk to me. About, I know you did. He was doing karate, black belt at twenty three. Yeah. yeah. So what was it actually? Can you dial down to exactly what inspired you to go right? I need to do X. I think um, first of all, um, my girlfriend had a very strong connection to both her brothers, so they were very close in her life. Um, so to go out with her, you almost had to be in the click <laughs> and they were quite lads in their own rights and they were new ice cream sort of grows and um it's, an, it's quite a rough place and you know they they were lads but i liked the way they carried themselves i liked i thought right that's that's what i want to get to next that's kind of how i want to be and then when i'm there i sort of you know i was like, stages but i think they just stood out as young men that I thought, yeah, I want to be like that. I want to be like them. I liked their characters. I liked um, their family. I liked, yeah, I just thought they were brilliant inspirations. They had, they had good look going on. They um, were funny. Um, they had a lovely sister at the time. So, oh, okay, yeah, well, that yeah, helped yeah, then, yeah, didn't it? <laughs> um, so, yeah, and, you know, the, the more I you know, went out there, the more I learned about them. I mean, he was a tiler and the eldest son Danny he was um working with his dad painting decorating not particularly happy in that um and unbeknown to me not particularly happy in life but it you know if you'd have seen him you wouldn't have ever thought that it in fact we went out with him that last week before the fatal event and um okay we you know you would have never have known You'd have never have known um, so this guy so the guy that inspired you yeah you're talking about yeah Danny so essentially it looked all okay from the outside is yeah what I'm saying. so you're yeah. looking up to this guy really inspiring you're seeing this top surface thing and, yeah. and then go on carry on yeah only <laughs> you never know what's going on mm. behind closed doors i suppose really and um he hit it well it's only in hindsight if i heard that word if only only we'd have said this if only we'd have done that if only we'd have you know but it was the last thing on our mind. We didn't think he would ever do anything like that. So all the, the three siblings, they sent their mum and dad on a trip to Germany for their anniversary. And the day that they got back, um, we were due to pick them up, um, them up, me and Nancy. And um, he phoned, Danny phoned, and um, he just asked if his sister had tried to ring. And I was like, oh, hang on, I'll just see. So I shouted up to Nancy, who's getting ready. These girls take a long time to get ready. And uh, I said, no, no, no one's tried to. But I think in hindsight, what he was trying to do is have that one last chat with his sister. And <laughs> I answered the phone. Um, and we went and got her mum and dad. We dropped them off. We went to go and get a takeaway. By the time we came back with the takeaway, um, I was at the door first and uh, dad just sort of grabbed hold of me. I thought it was going to hit me, just sort mm. of grabbed me. Just said, just go and get Nancy in. Mm. And I was like, mm. what's wrong? I was just go and get Nancy in. And it was then that it all came to light, what he'd what he'd done. And yeah, just like, definitely, oh, it had a profound effect to me in my life. It made me want to, um, yeah, I, yeah, I went back to church. Um, I, got baptised, it made me think more about afterlife and it just, yeah, it had a profound effect on me in more ways than you'll ever know.